as far as the writing sample goes, so far my my focus has been on the LSAT and kind of getting the score I want before I kind of move more through the application process and obviously the writing sample as well. Um, is that the best method or should should I be um, on my off time also considering the writing sample or when to take that? Um, and also like applications and personal statements, is that something I should be working in throughout this time as well? Yeah, since you're taking the LSAT in October and that's what you're aiming for, ideally you want to be able to submit your application once you get that score back. So you'll have okay. two to three weeks after the LSAT test date to wait for your score. During that time, you can finalize your application, but okay. I wouldn't save everything to the last minute. You have, mm -hmm. at this point, speaking in end of June, you have all summer. So yeah. when you want to take a break from the LSAT or if there's a day where you have a bit more time than otherwise, fit in some time for the LSAT there too, for the application there too. Take a break from okay. LSAT content here and there. LSAT's most important, but it's never too early to start working on your personal statement and getting letters or letters of rec together and all that. And okay, then great. I would do the writing sample during those two to three weeks after you take after the that. actual LSAT. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.